dragon's spirit floods your mind and memory in a great torrent of power. He is with you. He is within you. He is you. The next words that spill from your mouth are not yours, but the worms. I am Ansel, heart of the gate, butchered in flesh, risen in spirit. Ansel wends his way through your mind like an unstoppable river. Your body is unmoving, yet thought flows effortlessly between you. The spirit pauses, and you feel the astral prism stir. Ansel senses the Emperor's presence within it. Answer me, Facey. Why have you come? A deep sigh resonates within you. The torrent stills, only disturbed by the dragon's next words. Brack, my words aren't meant for you. They're meant for him. The Emperor stirs in the astral prism, then in you, calm, curious, and detached. presence has stirred me, as it ever did. I am awakened. Answer me. It's been too long. A name I once answered to. A name I did not expect to hear again. Least of all from the mouth of an old friend. Friend. Yes, and more. Until you killed me. Have you come to dance on my bones, Borderan? Was slaying me not satisfaction enough? Satisfaction? No. You left me no choice. You had every choice. You were becoming illithid. I offered you merciful death. You chose to fight. And now you bring your throne before me. How far has the great border and fallen? Stillness. Ansur's consciousness hovers just above yours, searching, seeing. Dear Ansur, enough! I gave you everything, Borderan, and you repaid me in slaughter. It is time I return the favor. Let my bones rise and the storms gather. Witness, Borderan, the final tempest has come. I am the heart of the gate. I am the one who rules. This time. 